What's going on guys, Ganja Master back, bringing you with a uh, quick update tutorial video for those of you that uh, have been having questions about how to join Pixelmon servers. I know they updated the um, version and the Forge version that you're going to be using, um, and they kind of changed the method on how you're going to be joining um, and setting it up to play. So uh, I'm going to show you real quick how to do it. Um, all you want to do, obviously, is go to Google, type in Pixelmon. Just click on the link that says pixelmonmod.com. Click on that. Sometimes it does take a minute to open up for some reason. I don't know why. Um, it's went this speed before on uh, multiple computers. Um, once you get here, this is going to be the home screen. You're obviously going to go to downloads. And then it will navigate you to a page, obviously, where all the downloads are. Um, same thing. It takes a minute to switch over to the other page. So just be patient with it. not usually this long do 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 there we go okay and once you get to this screen you're gonna download um, mirror one which is gonna be version 3.0.1 so I'm gonna go ahead and download it um, you gotta go through these little ad fly things just wait for the time on the top right to finish and the um, mod is, is rather big you'll see it's about three I think it's three or yeah 200 megabytes so it's pretty big. I'm not going to download this one. I'll just pull mine out and show you the process and how to do it because I've already have it. Um, once you do that, you're going to once you close out all this BS junk that opens up in your background. Um, and then once you do that, you're going to go back to the Pixelmon downloads page, which will look like as soon as we get to it. Um, do 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 do. Patience. Always takes less time just going straight back to the website than it does navigating with the back uh, back button in your browser. So just click on download. So when we get back in there, and then the next link we're going to be downloading is going to be the new updated version of Forge, which is going to be for version 1.6.4. So you're going to click on that link. Um, it's going to be on the downloads page, just where you downloaded the actual mod pack for Pixelmon. Um, it's going to be located in the same spot. Um, so pretty much you're going to download that. It's going to download straight to another another link. Drag both of those onto your desktop, and they should look something like... should look something like this. Okay, this is going to be your Pixelmon, which I'm on currently on version 2.5.7, just because that's a server that I play on. Um, is on that version still. The most up-to-date version, I believe, is 1.6.4. So it'll be version 3.0.1, so on and so forth. Um, and then this is the Minecraft Forge you're going to have downloaded. All you have to do is double-click the Forge, and it's an installer. Um, you have to at least go into the game one time on the, on the version that you're installing Pixelmon. So pay attention to what version you're going to be downloading. So if you download, um, say... Pixelmon 1.6.4. You need to go into a, to Minecraft vanilla regular, and at least start up a world of 1.6.4, so that you have a profile that is going to look. Do, do do do. Let this kick in. So it looks something like this. It's going to be your regular profile. Um, then once you install Forge, it's going to say Forge has been successfully installed. I'm not going to do it again because I've already have it installed, um, and I don't want to mess it up. So once you do that, you're going to open up your Minecraft browser again, just like this. Um, and then you should have a profile called Forge, if it'll give me the drop down. There we go. Um, it should have a profile called Forge. You want to click on that, make sure your version is correct, which it'll say over here. To your right, what version you're on. If the version that you're downloading is for 1.6.4, and this one says 1.6.4, then you did it right. What you want to do with that is just start the game, go back into the world that you created in the vanilla version, and then close out of it. And then, last step you want to do is if you're on a Mac, you want to type in this command. Um, it's squiggle-library-application-support. That's going to be how you're going to get to your .minecraft folder. If you're on Windows, you're going to type percent app data percent. Once you get into the folder, it's going to look... Um, it's going to look a little something like this. It's going to look different depending on what, um, what uh, if you're on Windows or if you're on Mac. And once you've installed that Forge, you're going to notice that a mods folder like this one is going to be <clears throat> automatically installed into your Minecraft, Minecraft directory. So what you're going to do is just open up the folder, 
and then you're just going to drag and drop the full zip. Don't unzip this file right here. Just going to drag and drop the full zip file into that folder. Close out. Open up Minecraft just like so. And I'm going to start your launcher once again. Make sure you're still on that Forge profile. Click play. It's going to load up your uh, your Pixelmon mod and your Forge for the first time um, together. You're going to get the regular Minecraft screen. And then once the screen loads, it should tell you, if it'll load, there we go, um, it should tell you in the bottom left hand side that you have four mods installed. Um, there is the mods tab so you can see what you have installed. These are all just with Forge. Uh, you can click on them if you want to read the description and then you got Pixelmon. Pixelmon, um, and this will tell you, it'll say version 2.5, but this will be the version you'll be looking for when you're going to join servers. Um, and then this is a server that I play on, so I'll give you guys the IP for this. Um, it's playpixelbuilt.org. Um, I play on that one. It's pretty good. These are uh, um, a YouTuber's servers that I haven't really played on yet. So once you do that, just search for the server you want, join the game, and you'll be good to go. There's uh, my Pokemon, so on and so forth. And um, yeah, so that's all you got to do. It's very simple. Um, I know that it did change, so that's probably why a lot of you were asking me questions on how to join and sending me um, Skype messages and commenting on the video and whatnot. So, this is the updated version as of uh, February 28th, I believe, 2014. If you guys have any other questions regarding this or need help, just shoot me a comment um, or message me on uh, Twitter, whichever one you find uh, easiest to get in touch with me. And until next time, guys, has been good.